Alex Yu Show 300 seconds of daily wisdom to inspire you to live a life worth living. Healthful, joyful, and meaningful. Hi, I'm Alex Yu, and today we're talking about Mind Triumph Level 1, where we talk about replacing fear with knowledge. And in these 300 seconds, the topic is a big one, and that is Does God exist? And the answer is, yes, of course. Now, the important distinction here is, though, God doesn't exist like an entity sitting somewhere, judging here, this person, that person, because you did this, oh, now I'm going to punish you, and then I'm going to punish her, and no, that's not how it works. This is a creature or a being created by religion solely to do what? to instill fear and control people. Now, I'm not sure if that was the original intention of why religions were created, but it sure seems that way today and throughout the years has grown to be that way, a way to control people through fear. Now, in these 300 seconds, I hope to change that for you and to give you a different definition of God, one that encompasses everything, one that is everything in a, a definition where there is no separation of any kind. What we mean here is that God is everything, including you, including the thoughts of yours, of God. When you're thinking of God, that's also God. Everything is God in, in the word God. But a better definition is a source, a totality, a a platform, if you wish, of which everything comes forth, including you and your ability to play in this three-dimensional world and express God three-dimensionally. Understanding that God is everything, a foundation, and it, in its very essence, it's pure love. That foundation in, in its very essence is pure love. How I know that is because if it wasn't, we wouldn't be able to do whatever it is that we want to do on this planet. Look at us. We basically do whatever we want on this planet, right? And so that allowance only equals pure love. You only allow people, let's say your kids or even your pets, to do what you want, whatever they want to do is because you love them unconditionally. And it's the same thing with the source. The source does not love you unconditionally. It is unconditional love. By definition, it can only love unconditionally in a state of being. That is what God is. An unconditional state of being, of love. An unconditional love always in a state of being. Without judging you in any possible way. Understanding that will give you an amazing amount of peace of mind and relaxation and the opposite of fear. Understanding that this is all one. That we... that. This totality is God, that there is no one judging you, that you are able to do whatever you need to do in this planet to experience, to grow, to gain the knowledge and to have that completion of whatever it is that you're looking for. That removes amazing amount of stress. It removes fear out of your life. Fear of what? You, as an essence, are a direct part of God. There is no separation between you and God. There's no such thing. There's not possible. The only way there's a separation between you and God is verbally in your mind as thoughts. But the funny thing here is, or the irony if you wish, is that even those thoughts that you contemplate or you have accepted deep down inside, that they're just like part of you, that God is an entity that judges you, even those thoughts are, in essence, God, because they're part of the totality. There isn't anything that is not that God that we call, that source of totality. It's all part of it. It's all one, expressed in all different kinds of dimensions that you can imagine and that there are, for the sole purpose of you and all of us to experience ourselves and all these things in a physical, three-dimensional world. You do not fear God. You 
allow God to be what it is and that's pure love and you will feel that love because it is in and all around you that is the source it's pure love foundation a source that is what we refer to God a pure being a state of love allowing that to be removes the fear and the stress of an entity that punishes you and allows you to be who you are you are an amazing being I'm Alex Yu, inspiring you to live a life worth living, full of health, joy, and meaning. In today's 200 seconds, we talked about Mind Triumph Level 1 and Does God Exist? Until tomorrow and until then, keep on mind triumphing. Bye for now.